You knew, but didn't do a thing about it? Why? Suddenly sprout a conscience just yesterday? My father had flaws. I know this. I harbor no illusions about it. When a foe needed removal, my father ordered it without a thought to mercy. A way of being Yorinobu could not abide. But to my father, ends ever justified means. Saburo Arasaka has always valued just one thing. Do you know what it is? Let me take a guess. Power. Family. Oh, never mind. Our family. Whew. I was to be its heart. To uphold life. Ensure continuity. Stability. Never to oppose it. Guess Yorinobu's instructions were a little different? Yorinobu raised his hand against our father. But he is an Arasaka. He is family. I do not expect you to understand. I wish you merely to know I do not oppose my brother willingly. That it is difficult. Okay, so you're just giving me a spiel, but in all reality, you didn't really answer my question. Mm -hmm. He's your brother. It's been hard, it'll be hard. Let's say I get that. But what changed your mind? Yeah, come on. We received a warning during the parade. Security protocols were violated. The first doubts sprouted then. They grew yet greater in your hideout when my brother's assault group arrived not to rescue, but to kill. Yurinobu was just plain willing to sacrifice you. My father was right about my brother. He never cared for us. I was brought up to be the heart of the family. It is time for the Arasakas to listen to their heart. It will bring justice. Did you bring Soul Killer? As we agreed, you Finger would. Finger on the trigger. Don't say a word. Wait, what? Johnny, what do you mean? Talk to me. Seem on edge? Something got you spooked? I don't know you're not telling three me three times now that ab has flown by you're not telling Think me someone something. might have told you we must not get distracted did you bring soul killer take me for a fool think i'd fall for that got plans to walk out of here alive had i any ill intentions i would have chosen a side far more discreet than this we are here because i know how to save your life so tell me I how. I can lead you to Mikoshi. Minen, Mikoshi don't exist in real space. Yet its access points do, and one is very near. Where? Here in Night City, beneath Arasaka Tower. We ought to leave. Right now. Johnny, why are you so hesitant, bro? Let, let her speak. Want her leave. Cook. What gave you that idea? Quit button in so I can hear her out. This is gonna be a disaster. Sit. We have little time. And you'll help me in exchange for... My brother. You catch a whiff of that? Smells like shit. Careful not to step in it. He must be made to take responsibility for his deeds. Ah, so she wants me to what? Get rid of him? Of course, this isn't going to be an easy exchange. Hmm. Just say it. Be easier that way. I want him punished. Still vague. You want him dead. Say it. I want the Arasaka Corporation to know the truth. How you plan to do this? Yorinobu will soon call a meeting of the board. Representatives of all factions are expected to attend. The perfect moment for them to learn the circumstances of my father's death. I will get you into this meeting, and you 
will testify against my brother. Wow. Testify. Listen, mind if I'm stray with you? Help me get rid of Yorinobu. I will help you get rid of the construct. Let's assume it works. Then what? You take the Arasaka throne? Where would you get that idea? Figured it as a given. Besides, Takamura said you were supposed to step in for Yorinobu here in Night City. Everyone must know their place, V. That is a fact my brother has never understood. I know my place, and I have no wish to change it. No wish to, or no permission, you being a woman. I decide my own fate, as should you. So? Want me to throw Yorinobu under the bus in front of Arasaka Top Brass? Call me crazy, but that sounds like fucking suicide. This I know, and that is why we will take all the necessary precautions. Like, such as? You will see. What? You will see? Offer's intriguing. Need to think about it. Naturally. But think quickly. Yorinobu is on high alert after the parade. He may harbor suspicions. Let's fly the fuck out of here. V? Do you feel alright? Huh? You are bleeding. What? Fuck. Oh no. It seems you are running out of time. Don't delay. Make your decision. Ah! I'll think it over. Shit, come on. Come on, man. Don't malfunction again. You could use some air. Right now. Okay, cool. I'll get some air, but at this point... Ooh. <coughs> Lord. Oh, shit. Come on, V. Oh, Lord. Come on. First of all, what happened to the other... Um... Huh. So I guess this is the only thing that's open for me to complete. Okay. I'll leave. V, I say something. What, what are you doing? Shit, we'll be hours from it now, V. And you can't stand on your own two feet. Well, I'm good to go. Body listens to me. What are you suggesting, see Johnny? what I'm getting at? Of course I can see. Want me to hand over the keys. I want to save your life. Pop some pseudo endo Scooch and let me get behind the wheel. I'll get us to fucking Mikoshi. Uh-huh. Oh, exactly. Without that porcelain cunt's help, that's for damn sure. Don't stand a chance without help. Right about that. But that's why I'll bring Rogue. She's not rusted through just yet. Plus, she owes me. Maybe she just stuck her neck out for you a half a century ago. But now, I don't see it. I'll convince her. After all, we know a thing or two about ops like this. We'll blast our way into Sokka Tower, just like we did back in the day. Then find the way inside Makoshi. It's our only chance. What about Pan Am? She offered help. Listen up, V. Those guys are trailer tuggers. No, they're not. An they like to help. An assault on just not another convoy to Jack. You already tried this with amateurs. Both know how that ended. And you... tried it with pros. Didn't end any fucking better. That is true. You She's making a point, Johnny. Involved. Their lives on the line. Possibly on your conscience. Our one hope is sitting at the afterlife right now, and her name is Rogue. Hanako's offers on the table. I'm sorry. Whose? Oh, God, the crap. She actually has power. Could be our ticket. Yeah, one-way ticket to the city morgue. 
That Sokka cunt scrambled your circuits. Rogue and I will handle this, just like we used to. Damn, man. Rogue, I don't know. You honestly think it could work? With her experience, her resources, her connections. True. Won't find anyone better in NC. Johnny. It's gotta work. We breach the tower. Alt cracks open Makoshi. Then I fuck up that. Oh shit. Great, you checking out again? What the fuck's going on? Don't move just yet. Why am I being operated on? What are you putting in me? Or taking out? You're in pain, I know. Delirious when you arrived, so I had to dose you with beta haloperidol. I don't even know what that is, but, but okay. Light oversensitivity is a good sign. Means your optic nerves aren't damaged. My head. Ah. Uh, Almost done stabilizing the biochip. No, feels like someone's using your head as a knife block. How? How did I get here? Dragged yourself here, beat to hell and back. Gave Misty a hell of a fright. Oh, poor Misty. Then you shoved my patient at the time off the table, and demanded you be treated immediately. Talman was your guardian angel. Shut up, Johnny. Huh? I wasn't completely myself. Yeah, I know. And that's a bit worrying. All right, Vic. Give it to me straight. Just give it to me straight, Vic. You've come to a critical juncture. Okay. Try sitting up carefully. Okay, but don't expect a miracle. <sighs> Sit slowly. Another victory for the history books. Hmm. If you got something to say, Vic, just say it. How much longer is this going to go on? What do you, you mean? You tell me. Looking at you, not long at all. Shit. Next attack, you won't be able to crawl back here. You'll flatline in some back alley. Look at Misty in the background. This is your last chance to take matters into your own hands. Understand? Yeah, I know. Thoughts on where to start? Jesus, again. Do I have to spell it out? It's in your hands, not mine, and not those of that thing in your head. Now, see that setup over there? Yeah? What about it? You'll find a last dose of pseudo-endotrizin there. A gift from Misty. Want to give in to the voices in your head? Go ahead. Take a puff. Go silent. Get out. Or find another way. End things on your own terms. Got a little present for me over there, too. Blockers. Manage to walk those few yards to the table. The rest will be up to you and you alone. You heard him. We've got one last chance. I'm taking the wheel. Endotrizine, Rogue Sokka Tower. Only way this is gonna work. Give it a fucking rest, Johnny. It's my decision. And I gotta think about it. Need to stretch, stretch your noodle? noodle. Fine. Fine. Just not, it's in, not this in this basement. V, Christ, you're talking out loud. Uh, out loud? What? Just go fix this thing. <laughs> think I can do it. Whatever you decide, let's make sure to get out of here first. Oh, Vic. 
Can't thank you enough for all you've done, Vic. Only wish I could have done more. Go on now. I want to close up. Take the meds and do what you gotta do, V. Thanks, Vic. I will. And you hang in there, too. Good luck, kid. Oh, Lord, have mercy. Fine, I'll take the pills. Hey, V, I heard. Well, your thoughts? Shouldn't have had to. Sorry about that. No need to be. I know what's going on. And I know it won't be easy for either of you. If you don't want to decide here, I know a much better place. Sure. Got a feeling Vic's had enough of me as is. Don't be mad at him. His chakras are all blocked up today. Plus, he's had too much coffee. Let me guess. My aura's sputtering? Mm-hmm. Afraid so. Sure. Lead the way. Why is this spot special? I took Jackie there once. It's not far. Jackie? What, what's he gotta do with any of this? You'll see. Come on. I haven't seen Misty in a long time, honestly. I'm glad I'm able to see Vic and Misty before I make the big decision, honestly. Top floor. Okay. He had the same glum face. Who, oh, Jack? This is it, Chica. I'm done for. Doesn't sound like the Jackie I knew. That was a long time ago. His mom had just found out he'd signed up with the Valentinos. Trust me. Senora Wells on one shoulder, your gang Chumbas on the other. No choice can ever seem right. Mm hmm. Life wasn't easy for my Jackie, but. He found the courage to bet on himself. After. I brought him here. Ah, that's more like it. Air. See that? Yeah, I see. I come here when I need to get away. Be alone with my thoughts. She's on to something. Ought to sit, mull through some shit yourself. Okay, fine, I'll sit. Damn. Thanks, Misty. You were right. Choice spot. So what? What did Jackie decide up here? Oh, you know. I'm gonna be a legend in this city. And I'm gonna leave you alone now. Take your time. Fucking scared me, know that? Thought you were on your way out. No, still here. For now. You know, should call anyone you want to say goodbye to. Worst case scenario. That what you expect? No. But whatever you decide, risk's gonna be high. If things don't go our way. Just fucking do it. Anyone you gotta talk to, now's the time. Pills can wait. Yes, call Judy. Judy. Yeah, even I've grown to like her. She ought to know that. Hey, Judy. Oh, hey, V. What's cracking? Time we, uh, went swimming. Hmm? A lot of fun, wasn't it? What you said then, about what you sensed in me. Death. High time I faced it. Can't be sure it'll work, but I gotta try. 
Listen, whatever it is you're gonna try, just be careful, okay? I'm here waiting. Thanks. Do my best. I love you. <sighs> okay. I love you, Judy. What's good you called? Wish I'd had the chance to. Come a long way to get here, haven't we? Yes, we have. Just think. It all started in a fucking landfill. <laughs> then you tried to kill me. See exactly what I mean. Trying to save your sorry hide now. You can let me do that. Or you can try Pan Am and her tarmac rats. But then their lives will weigh heavy on your soul. Or you take Arasaka's deal, but then you'll have your own soul on your conscience. Damn, what should I pick? Fuck. Fuck it. I'm gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You absolutely sure? No going back on this, you know. Oh Lord. Just hold on a minute. Need to think. Pam. Fuck it. Gonna try to ask Pan Am for help. You absolutely sure? Yes, I am. No going back on this, you know. I am absolutely positively sure. Gonna try this with Pan Am. We're a lot alike. Trust her more than any of your iron for hire chumbas. Have it your way. Could be my last ride, this. If it don't work out. Just want to be there for it. Aware. See you inside, Makoshi. Johnny? Hey, just me now. Hey, Pan Am. Do you know what time it is? I know. I know. But need your help. You owe me a favor. What's so damn urgent I couldn't wait until morning? Need a way into our socket tower. Now. Sorry, what? I'm serious. Whole thing with Johnny. I don't do something soon. I'm done. Gone. I'm Slow dying. Down. First, why our socket tower? The tech. Underneath that tower, they got an access point to... Well, odd as it sounds, a prison of souls. A prison of souls? <sighs> Knew this might not fly over the hollow. Wakoshi, that's its name. Only place Johnny and I can disentangle for good. It's my last chance. So, again, just to be clear... You've called me at High Moon to ask me to help you break into Arasaka Tower, or you'll die. Yep. About the gist of it, yeah. Okay. W okay. Where are you? She's coming! Vic's clinic. The Ripper? Right. I know where it is. Can you hold off on dying for a bit? Give it a shot, sure. Good. Don't go anywhere. I'm coming to get you. Oh shit. Oh shit, Pam! Yo, it's a good thing I called her. Yo. That's my girl right there. That is my fucking girl right there. I love you, Pam. I love you. Seriously. She did say to call her for help, right? And I did. And guess what? She's now delivering. Fucking fantastic. And I get it. Johnny wants to save me. That's fine. But... Listen. Is that you, V? I want to do things my own or... way. Yeah, it's me. So, what now? Waiting for my driver. 
Come inside. We'll wait together. Sweet. I wasn't gonna kill myself. I'm not gonna do that. I'm not gonna off myself without explaining or even try and say goodbye or make amends. You know? Since you have to wait, mind if I give you a reading? Sure, why not? Talk to me. Some believe uncertainty is an evil that should be dispelled through divination. Others claim it's change that is evil. But that isn't true either. Every minute of every day, we each become someone new. We shouldn't fear change itself, but only who we might change into. Knowing one's path is most important. I devised this layout especially for you and Johnny. Your future is his future, and vice versa. Okay, I'm ready. We'll start with you, V. The Fool. Hmm. <laughs> what a surprise. Very fitting, the Let's title. Let's dig deeper to find its meaning here. The okay. Fool symbolizes the start of a journey, the announcement of something new. It's the inner child, curious of the world, but also naive and reckless. <laughs> Sounds a lot like the V I first met. The one that the came magician. here. A person of great talent and charisma. A leader. Sounds like Johnny. The card is reversed. That can mean a tendency toward addiction, mental instability. Sounds oh, like Johnny. Okay, definitely Johnny. Yep. He's <laughs> one great disturbance. Yep. The final cards are about your futures. The lovers. Something that doesn't give me the chills. Finally. Balance, friendship, love. Is that Judy? Though it can also mean difficult choices ahead. Ain't that the truth. Okay, and Johnny's? The moon. Well, that doesn't sound too bad, right? I don't know, V. What do you mean you don't know? The moon is mystery. That's Pam. Hmm. I think that's for you. Yep. No mistake in that ride ever. Pam. I... Man, it's good to see your face. Jesus, you really do look terrible. Yeah. I feel worse. It's getting worse, and we had best not waste any time. We have a long road ahead of us. Come on. Everybody's waiting at camp. Look out for yourself, V. You too, Misty. And thanks for everything. Thank you for watching. This is Lover of Ladies, and I'll see you next time.